What is up, YouTube? Jonas Fats, I'm back playing the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. We are going to be doing another uh, mod checkout of another mod that I've seen on the workshop that I've never actually tried out. This one is called Crown of Stone or Quake Shot. Sorry, Quake Shot is the mod name. Crown of Stone is the item name. Not confusing whatsoever. Uh, playing on my third save file here, and I'm just going to load up a new run. May as well do Isaac, and while this loads, and I'll show you the seed, ARLJHQ0J, I'm going to give a brief overview. This is a mod created by Nato Potato and Catna Overdose. Catnip Overdose. I don't know why I had so much problems saying that. Uh, anyway, this is a item that works basically like the Quake Shots from... Uh, Mega Fatty, Champion Mega Fatty from the Cage, from um, the, some of the other characters that exist that do the rock stuff that exist, and that that's going to be the premise of this. I am going to the way that I'm going to play this is I'm going to skip the look. I know I, I said this, but I'm going to skip the first item room and spawn it, and that's what we're going to roll with in uh, in the episode here. So. I was trying it out early, you can see it there. If you want to uh, spawn it, that's how you do so. So I did want to spawn the, uh, the pedestal here to kind of show off. This is the icon for it. And there we go, crown of stone. You can see we got our little crown here. It looks pretty cool. The uh, left and right animations are all the same. Looks good. And basically the way it works, you can see it there. I have no idea if this is strong or not. And uh, we'll, we'll go through it. And apparently it does work with uh, some of the other items in the game. We will check it out. Um, Oh, you know what? There's also uh, somebody else I missed on here that I just saw reading in the description here. Demon Pixel is the designer. NATO Potato is the coding and the implementation specialist. It doesn't actually have a title on it, but that's what they say. And Catnip Overdose was the sprites, which I just realized was a... It's a play on Katniss Everdeen, I think, but I don't know for sure. Um, we're going to try this out. Apparently it does work with the sprinkler incubus and some other synergies as well so we're just going to get into this run and check it out and i don't know if it it does take out the skulls too so first thoughts this seems like very overpowered um but i don't know how much damage this will actually do looks like it pierces and i actually just realized that this our uh, avatar changes for like half a frame or maybe like not half a frame what the hell's half a frame um it changes for a couple frames, meant like half a second, when we actually fire. That's kind of cool. I like that. I really like the design of this. Um, it kind of throws a different feeling into it. I don't think it's like terribly overpowered. It's not like a brimstone or mom's knife. Oh, we're on an XL floor. So do I. What was my rules? I didn't set rules for this, so I'm going to reroll it. Ah, it's not very good. All right. So basically what I'm looking for is just to uh, see what kind of cool synergies we get in the run. Don't really want to do that. Like apparently, like I said, it works with uh, some of the other stuff here. Um, I guess it works with Mom's Knife. Like maybe what I'll do is I have the... They've got like a description of basically what it works with um, in the uh, on the mod page here. So maybe like when we get an item that I think, oh, maybe that'll work with it. We just check, confirm it. I don't know if you know this or not, but um, every synergy that exists in the game, at least it was like this for uh, Afterbirth and Rebirth, they're all hand-coded. There's no magical um, program or algorithm. Why is it shooting the wrong way sometimes? There's no magical algorithm that runs the synergy for it just kind of like works through the math behind it how they do that with like 500 and some odd items in the game i got no idea i don't think i think that's why there's a lot of items that just generally don't work together because they're not programmed to but we'll see uh maybe we'll reroll that we'll see what we get in here goat head is a take that's a take. 
and I wish I was not an idiot and came in here with a reroll. However, pretty happy to have that, and I actually am going to take this. We could go right now, but I'm going to do a little bit more digging around this, this level. I don't know if this finds secret rooms or anything. We're going to find out. You and me together. Um, but yeah, I wanted to do like a couple more of the mod look at. It's not to say, again, that I am... I was going to say, uh, by any means, like getting bored with vanilla or regular Isaac runs, it's actually like not the case at all. But I just wanted to do some like other look at with it as we get through um, some of the other stuff that exists in the game. That's not going to be a secret room. It's not there. I don't, like I said, I don't know if this finds it or not, but we're going to try. It's an explosion, technically, right? It didn't blow up the bomb rock. Interesting. This floor is bigger than I would hoped. All right, we're on an XL floor there. We're still, like, relatively uh, ahead of schedule. That was close. I don't think this makes us immune to bombs either, so or explosions rather, but we do need to watch out. Honestly, the uh, the damage on it is, it seems pretty expected, uh, which is actually kind of nice. I could have sworn I was charged. The range seems okay out of the gate. I'm guessing it's impacted by the range that you get in the game. Yeah, overall, uh, I'm quite, quite liking it. I'm gonna check. No, could be here. Now I'm questioning myself on whether or not I can actually figure out where a secret room is. I don't know if I check this side. You know, we can check this. Okay, it doesn't find them. It would have opened that door at the top there. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Anyway, if you do, um, if you see any mods that are kind of uh, up your alley or you think that is something that I would kind of enjoy, hit me up. Hit me up on Twitter. Leave a comment. Um, and uh, we'll... I'll do my best to try it, basically. Really hoping for like a seven cents champion belt. Can't help but notice that that's not happening. All right. That's fine, I guess. What deep pockets gave you an item? I think I'm losing my mind. Uh, hindsight, I probably would have... Oh, we can get back in. Oh, that's... Risky. May as well take this, I guess. F it. I believe we can fly. We got spirit of the night, and now we're high in the sky. Ooh, babe, babe. Whoop. We got earthquake tears. Oh, yeah. I believe I can fly. I believe I'm going to win this run. All right, we'll stop that. That was stupid of me, not of the game. We got to check the mushrooms. All right. Oh, come on. You should have taken. Oh, my God. This guy's huge. Okay, let's not die. That's not like a great I or a bad idea. Strength card is okay. Gotta take it. Guillotine. Actually like guillotine. So I'm not necessarily thrilled to have it. I'm not not thrilled. I have no bombs. I'm just checking. Just checking. You never know what's here. Alright, yeah, no, guillotine is actually fine. Um, I think it guillotine is one of those items where it seems terrible when you first play the game. But then, um, as you kind of progress further, you realize it's not terrible. And then as you get further in the game, you realize it's actually a piece of crap and you never want to use it again. 
But I'm kind of in the boat of... I like to think I can use it in an okay fashion. I'm not the greatest guillotine person. However, I like to think that I can do okay with it. Alright, this is actually causing a, not an issue, but an interesting kind of uh, scenario. Oh, you know, we got a strength card. Oh, this is perfect. Oh, oh, it didn't quite match the speed. Oh, come on. Get down. We got a deal. Magic 8-Ball. All right, here's what we do. Use a strength card, they're both two card deals. Grab this one. Death's Touch is actually kinda good. Not great, but real, real good. It's a solid, like, B plus. No, Death's Touch is an A item. Okay, that shot up. I did notice that a couple times, like, on the last floor, that there is, like, a little bit of a weird shot direction. I don't know if that's tied to the controller usage or not. Like, the fact that I'm using a controller or not. However, um, it is, like, it's happened a couple times. Kind of wish I didn't open that. So I'm not in a rush here. I got my save file over here. I'm not really, um... Excuse me? Uh, I'm not looking to, like, have a streak or anything. I just felt the need to uh, segregate the, the mod videos from the Eden streak that we're hopefully going to get uh, up there anyway. Can't do anything with that. All right, I actually think we're done with the floor. Curse of the Blind kind of nullifies the D6 pretty hard, so it's not much we can do. However, we can check for a secret room. Could be three black hearts. It's not. It's like the worst trinket in the game. Literally the opposite. Uh, let's go. We can't take that, right? <sighs> we can't take that. If I had like Guppy's collar, I probably would. There's a library. Uh -huh. I wonder how um, other items work with this. Like, um, what am I th I'm thinking like more specifically, like a non-traditional item. Like, um, oh my god, uh, anti-grav. Holy crap! I lost my freaking train of thought. I can't be the only one that does that. Like. I do this, like, probably more than I should, but I lose my train of thought sometimes, and like, it's really hard for me to get back in that station to find it. Because I'm like, oh, yeah, no, we're doing this, and then I'm like, what the hell was I doing? Like, the other day, I almost put Cheerios in the fridge because I get distracted because I, I think about something else. And then I'm like, all right, well, that was silly. Okay, there's three of you. Three amigos. Leave. Let's not die. We're not gonna die. Okay. Uh, get out of town. Please don't fire at me. This is a little cheap, but I don't really care because you guys killed my random streak. So I literally hate you. Why aren't you moving? Oh, there you go. Literally the worst thing to say to spiders. You see them in your house and you're like, why aren't you moving? You realize like, ah, it's moving. Run away, burn the house. All right, we uh, oddly enough need to get like a damage up. Not like a big damage up, but we gotta get a damage up. Stone tears. Anyway, um, really quick on the uh, the mod note though. I think that's how I'm gonna do the, the mods that give you like the single item. Um, I think that downward shot was on me. Is like spawn at mystery sack is really good. Let's leave it for now. Nah, I gotta take mystery sack. You gotta take it. It is like, it is real good. 
I don't think that one was on me. Anyway, um, that's why I think I'm gonna do this single item uh, mod videos so that we can kind of take the, if there's only like one item, I'm not like downplaying it. Like, I don't think that was, why did I just stand there? Um, if the mod itself is a single item, we're just gonna start with that item and I'll, I'll spawn it in our item room and I'll skip the first item just kind of like even out the run a little bit so it's not uh, crazy powerful. Uh, I probably should have got hit by that bone. Excuse me. Thank you. Uh, range up actually not that bad. If we can get like enough range, it means like we can fire this bad stony boy across the entire map. All right, that was good, that was good. Let's go peep the boss. Good work. Thank you, Stony Tears. I feel like it will do like a decent job against Chubb here. Ah, it's not really doing that great of a job on its own. I mean, we'd have 11 damage. Okay, I'm trying to like walk away from the uh, the stone to see if our shot speeds have any impact. I don't think it does, like the way that uh, we're walking. Like we can directionalize it. Is that a word? Doesn't matter if it is. Might reroll that. Um, yeah, we'll take that. I would love to take that, but we can't yet. So I'm gonna reroll. We can take the pack, pack to, and we might be able to reroll that as well. So that was a pretty good damage upgrade. Definitely feeling better about that. The pack is one of the grest. The I just said grest. Oh my gosh, I am losing my mind. Uh, it's one of the best devil item deals. Devil deal items. Just like give up on me. I tell you, this video is getting off the. I wonder if this works. Don't know if that worked. It did not work. I demand the sticky nickels to be uncovered by my avatar, Aang. Not Aang. What the hell was the name of the... Oh my god, I can't remember her name now. On Avatar The Last Airbender. There was the freaking Earthbender. That was like badass. She could bend rocks and shit. What was her name? Oh, it's gonna kill me if I don't know it. it starts with an O, I think. I think. There are no batteries. All right, what we're gonna do, we're gonna buy a battery. I do want that nickel though. I was gonna say, is her name Otep? And then I forgot that that's actually like uh, a metal band. Really weird metal band, actually. It came on, like we were, um, we were out, we were setting something up, but I don't remember what it was. It was a party or something we were setting up and I had my phone out and I was playing music and I have one of the Otep albums on there and I forgot about it. And it came on and it was like a really weird one. Uh, I mean, they're, they're not like weird. I'm not gonna like shame anybody's metal decisions. I'm really tempted to play that. Um, but it was like one of the ones, it wasn't really a song, it was more of like a, uh, not even like a talking. Basically, the premise of the, uh, the track is the easiest way I can put that, um, was like a dude had a webcam or something and she found him and put him on camera, and I was like, oh, this, uh, this got weird and scary because I have a webcam, although I don't record myself doing all sorts of weird things, just playing a game where you play as a child that cries rocks at his 
fictional enemies in his mother's womb. Yeah, I think I'm on a list now. If I wasn't on a list before, these Let's Play videos have done it. It's really weird, like, I don't feel that the damage on the, uh, the rock tiers really scales as the same uh, level that our tiers would. That was good. I tried to do, like, the head dodge on him. Like, we have, like, a lot of damage right now. If we were running just a normal Isaac, we would, like, be killer. Uh, sure. Greed. Literally the worst time to fight you, Greed. You know. They, I notice that the rocks do change colors based on uh, where we are in the, uh, in the game, though. That's really cool. So they were, like, brown before because we were in the caves. Now we're in the depths. They're black. Like, that's a nice little touch. Oh, come on. Don't run away. So we haven't got anything that um, really changes the feeling for the rocks, and I'm hoping that we do. I want to see how anti-grab works. Second guppy item. Don't know if guppy does anything with big old rock tears, but we'll maybe find out, actually. Okay. Where is my other item room? Please give me my other item room. Oh, yeah, no, there's more enemies than just the one there. All right, good work. Just bash your head against this dude. There we go. These bonies, it's actually like a little bit trickier to aim than you might think. Alright, good stuff. You guys gotta go. Oh, you guys get deflected by the soul. Did not know that. But apparently that guy does not. Makes sense. Get back here. Get back here. Get that spider out of here. I actually think we probably got hit there, but it didn't register. Alright. Don't question it. I mean, we like, can just leave this room. Might get a red chest, though, so... I don't really want to... Like, this only takes like, one second. Not get the red chest, I can't help but notice. We did not get Guppy. Not very happy about that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hurt me plenty, baby. Mm-mm-mm. I should really play the new Doom. I don't even know if I own it. I gotta find out. New Doom runs on the, um... The Vulcan engine, right? Can't remember. Are we going to talk about graphics cards at some point? I don't know if we are. That seems like a really controversial topic. Yo, are you AMD or are you uh, NVIDIA? I mean, everybody's NVIDIA right now, but... There are a lot of AMD people that are very, very passionate. All right. All I'm going to say on the topic is that I was expecting a little bit more from AMD on it. Um, I don't want to say that they under-delivered, but they're competing with like their new cards, which are I don't think technically released yet, are not up to spec with cards that were released like over a year ago. It's not, like, the best decision, I think. And I know that it's because they use, like, a new HPM RAM set or some shit. Memory bus management. Other key 
keywords that I don't understand. That being said, maybe if it wasn't ready, the memory wasn't ready, maybe you shouldn't have used it. Although I do kind of want one. Although they're pretty much the same price. That's the other thing too. I think they, uh, if they did like what they did with the Ryzen, which I think sounds like an amazing CPU, maybe they could have done that with the GPU and kind of would have had uh, some people pretty happy with them. Charge lower. If they would have came out with performance at or above the 1080 Ti, but for like $200 less, like not a crazy amount less, you went up and you shouldn't have. Um, they would have, I think, taken the market. I'm looking at building a new computer right now, and I'm looking at like the 10i, 1080 Ti, and I'm like, this shit is pricey. And easily be the most expensive graphics card I've ever bought. And part of me is like, yeah, this shit's gonna be outdated in like a year. Why am I buying this? Alright. Enough jib jab. That was terrible. Get stoned. Okay, good work. All right, we got this. Where the hell is a boss room? So overall, my thoughts on the mod, uh, actually literally my first time playing it, um, it works like really well. I think maybe the damage doesn't scale in either the same way or differently than it does with like other tiers, like normal tiers. But, it seems okay. I mean, we're gonna try out the Magician card. Sure. We'll grab Onk. Onk, Onk. Not really interested in the sack room. I mean, we have like, nearly 12 and a half damage. And, I feel like we should be killing things faster than we are. Overall though, like, it's it's a really cool concept. I really, really like it. So I don't want to complain, like, too heavily about it. And it's not even really, like, complaints. I think there's minor... Mi not even issues. I don't even know how to word it. Minor notes that I have. Magician Justice. Tower not interested. Basically, I'm saving the Emperor card for the Cathedral, in case you're not there with me. Because I think Isaac's going to be a little bit of a slog with our current setup here. Unless we get Guppy. It could still happen. No. Get out of here, bone face. He walked right through it. What a jerk. All right. Um, let's just check this. Oh, I totally forgot this was an XL floor. All right, just get the orbits in there. I guess we'll use the uh, ma magician, magician against uh, good old Ma. We'll grab that. It is a solid tiers upgrade with two Thol hearts. Don't mind if I do. All right, let's find out. It does not appear to work. Yeah, that should have maybe found them. Get in there. God, I hate Blue Mom. Blue Mom, I don't like you, Blue Mom. Oh, right. Yeah, just walk like 100% through them. Smart play. Alright, don't accidentally re-roll the negative and the positive. 
And by positive, I mean Polaroid. I'm going to accidentally call it the positive going forward now. I'm going to call that right now. Alright, just get in there. Good stuff. And we got the guppy. Guppy, guppy, guppy. And Leviathan. We'll grab this. All right, we look terrifying. Um, let's find out if Guppy works. Not really a great start to find that. That was the worst dodge I've ever made. I was like, oh shit, it's coming right for me. Watch out, son. I don't think Guppy works with it. We're not generating flies. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Let's find out. A little bit other enemies. So we have no flies. That would... You turned on a friggin' dime there, dude. That should have generated flies. Uh, we do have some, but we do have infestation, in case you're wondering. That was a really, like, targeted... That was a blitz in football and you were the linebacker. All right, so Guppy did nothing. I feel silly re-rolling, or not re-rolling nine lives now. All right, we got hit like five times on this room. I should be ashamed. Should be ashamed. Shame this man. Boo this man. I watched Half Baked the other day. Pretty good movie. Brings me back. Uh, and also the Dave Chappelle freaking comedy specials were pretty good on Netflix. Gotta say that too. They we're not really like typical Dave Chappelle's kind of stuff. However, uh, I think that's like perfect. That's like what I'm looking for. Okay, you guys kind of suck with this. Just keep my distance. All right, let's keep going up. Good work. So I'm actually kind of getting the uh, the hang of this here. Oh, there's Tinted Rock. Good work. Kind of went just like... Right. That was a dumb move. I was going to say, I kind of want to just bomb my way through this room. Good. Good, good, good. This room sounds disgusting. Oh, it sounds like a Denny's on soup night with all the denture slurping. Like they're serving clam chowder and they didn't bring any spoons. So all the old people are just sipping from the bowl directly. And they all got chewing gum and they can't help but chew really loudly because that's what old people do. They go, mwah, mwah, mwah. That's what this sounds like. It sounds like somebody brought a pack of Trident down to the freaking old folks home. And when somebody said, did you bring enough to share? Somebody went, I sure did and gave freaking Trident gum to everybody. All right. See, like that one. That one shouldn't have gone up. That should have gone to the left. To the left, to the left. Quake Shack should have went all the way to the left. Um. Oh, you're still alive. Cold chest. Regular ass chest. Not even worth my time. You know what? Go like this. Nothing. Wow. Wow. Oh, F this friggin' room. That should have gone down. Okay, good work. Mystery Sack's gonna hold us together here. 
feel like this run would like should be like a 10 out of 10 a plus s tier freaking level but it's really not now to be fair i'm playing like shit and i'm getting hit like an absolute ton where i shouldn't however can't help but notice but we got like a lot of damage ups here and we got guppy and it's not really doing much for us these guys freaking suck like one of those shots i would have thought would have taken this dude out stop dodging see like that didn't take him out i feel like it should have Hmm. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know why. Like, maybe it's because, like, okay, here's the thing. Like, when you get, like, Brimstone or um, Mom's Knife and your damage is at, like, 13, you're, like, you're crushing it. You're just walking into rooms. They see you. They have heart attacks and they die. It doesn't really feel like that that's happening. And I think... The reason for that is that um, maybe our tier rate is the same even though we're hitting them. Like, it's, um, the tier rate isn't scaled like it does with Mom's Knife. Like, you can have, uh, like a 5 or 10 tier rate, rather, with Mom's Knife. It doesn't really impact much. So maybe there's, like, some coding stuff that is, like, really difficult. It feels like I'm doing, like, one tier of damage by hitting them with a rock. Or, like, two. And I don't think, I don't know, that, that's not, I don't know how you do that without being like super overpowered. And maybe it's designed not to be, but it feels like you have this item, maybe it should be. Or maybe like you really do need another item to make this really be a 10 out of 10. So I tell you, like the later we're getting in the game, the less, uh, stellar that the item is kind of becoming to me. I'm actually going to grab this right now. I think you got a reroll. I mean, we don't need any of those. Mm. Mm. F it. Why not? We're going to get one heart here anyway, and then Dark Prince's crown is up. So, yeah. Two of spades. We don't really need. Where did the spiders come from? Where? Yeah, see, I mean, not that it's like a one-to-one, -one, but that dude, it feels like the freaking copy Isaac does more damage than we do. stuff and I get that it's like insanely like not easy coding this kind of shit I get it I totally get it um, I'm just wondering if like there was the ability in the actual code to um, adjust maybe the uh, the damage scaling a little bit I don't know it seemed to move really fast that was terrible Alright, Mystery Sack, I need you to give me, like, one soul heart. Uh, so, we're gonna try this. I don't know if it works with it, but we're gonna find out. And let's reroll that. Nope. Mm, nope. Give me something that makes this awesome. Wait, wait, wait. This is the item I wanted to see if it works with. It does not appear to work with. It. it does not appear to work with it, and neither does Jacob's Ladder. Alright. That could be because I think Jacob's Ladder was a mod item itself, right? So I, I can forgive that one a little bit. I, I was kind of interested to see if Anti-Grab worked with it. And now we know it doesn't. So we're basically in the same boat we were, other than Anti-Grab is a small tiers upgrade. So for diamonds, we'll just pop gonna reroll that. That's uh let's take it. 
sure. It's an orbital. Orbital. Orbit, orbit, orbital. No, get out of the. Oh. Oh, it's a tinted rock there. Alright. Yeah, guys, come over here. Come hang out in the corner. I'm playing poker. I was on the rock, thank you. Uh, okay. So, honestly, I think the mod loses a little bit of um, coolness to me because anti-grab doesn't work. Uh, and Jacob Ladder, too. Jacob's Ladder, as well. However, I still really like the idea of this item. I would actually really like to get the sprinkler. If we can get the sprinkler on uh, the chest, that would be really cool to see if that works. And wait, I think it does, right? I think I said it did. I don't know if I did. Check this. Good. Good. Lots of money, but nothing. We got money, and we don't need it. Best bomb I've ever placed in my life. Oh, uh, black art's okay. Means that our boss is right here. Told ya. Yeah, like if you can't take a fistula in two hits, that's a problem. Yeah, I just stood still there. Oh, that's gonna be how like McGregor feels when he fights Mayweather. And if you don't think that Mayweather is just gonna frickin' tune him, you like, you don't know sports. Also, oh, I think that's a proper reference. Not 100%, I, I, I know that Mayweather is a boxer, and I know that McGregor is not a boxer. So it feels like if they're playing by boxing standards, it's kind of like one-sided, right? Maybe they should have chosen like a different sport, like basketball or something. Maybe they wear something where they're equally um, not great at, but both like okay. All right, Polycephalus has got to go. This mom fight is going to take a million friggin' years. Because our tears are not doing a ton. Oh my god, you spawned a chub. I did not think you were going to do that. Alright, let's not lose the run. New top goal. Not die. Good. You know what, get like a bomb in there. Get another bomb in there. Oh, the freaking there's like a slight delay when you shoot. I don't like it. Oh, this is like the longest mom fight I've ever had. We have 13.26 damage and it really doesn't feel like it. Am I like using this item wrong? I don't know. Okay, I got a little aggressive there and I took some damage that I shouldn't have. Almost done. Almost done. It went up. One more. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Oh, I mean like, may as well take some items here. I don't really want Gimpy, but I need the damage, so I'm going to kill myself there. That's fair. And then we're going to reroll Gimpy and we get a Thame. <sighs> it's not worth it. It's not worth it. One, two, three, four rooms. No batteries on the ground. There is an Eternal Heart back there. I'm going to go back for it. Holy moly. I did not think that this run would be so friggin' difficult. I'm not even gonna try the pills.
I was actually hoping for an error room. No, I don't want an error room. What the hell am I talking about? Give me that. Just pop it. Come back over here. Holy, this is how you know I'm serious. I start taking pills. I found pills. Yeah, this is why I don't take them. They don't really change much in the game. Ah, oh, they tend to screw you over sometimes. Alright, we got one over here because we fought lust, I think. Bad gas. Wonderful. GG. I still think that this is a secret room. It's not. Alright. Let's go up to the cathedral. Let's try to beat Isaac. I'm going to Emperor card like right away. Hmm. Yeah, let's do it. I was debating it for a second. Because we're not going to get like a reroll um, on the chest originally. But it's fine because we can still like come back to it if we need to. I do want to win. As much as I love playing mods, I need a win at, at my core. God, it gets it. Alright. We're getting there. Oh my god, I get hit. I hate phase two, Isaac. I hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it. Because of these little jerk faces and the bottom. And he's got the... Sons of bitches. I thought it spawned you back at the, uh, the first room for some reason. Okay. Try this again. Don't use your orbitals. That is a terrible idea. Alright, use the soul. We got this. Don't even worry. There's nothing to worry about. Why are you worried? I'm not worried. Are you worried? Am I... I'm a little worried. I'm gonna see if we can find the second secret room. Okay, just, you know what? No, we, we can do this room. Come on. Alright, Stone Tears, you've made this run, like, really difficult. Oh, I already put one there, you dumb. Dumb, dumb, dumb. Uh, okay. Just freaking... get to it just don't die you know what killed me on the last one is that not even like anybody's fault but my own it was the fact that I uh, walked in during that attack and that was silly okay just pay like a little bit of attention like, that was maybe not the best decision oh you Frickin', that's where you choose to spawn? Son of bitches! I... Mm. You know what? I'm gonna try this. Just to get through these phases. <sighs> I, can, I can do it, I can do it, I can do it. Get through to phase three. All right, we did it. Holy moly. I think if we got phase three, I think we're okay. Okay, okay, okay. No, get out of here. Isaac, no. Bad Isaac. Bad Isaac. This is your bad Isaac. 
Who's a bad Isaac? You're a bad Isaac. No. Get out of here. Don't mimic my moves, dude. No. Don't do the spinny one. Don't do the spinny... He did the spinny one. Oh, good. Swallowed Penny. Alright. We need to get him to phase three again. As soon... <clears throat> oh, we need to get him to phase three. As soon as fucking possible. Alright, there we go. Now we're just gonna like, just gonna take our time. He's not gonna do the spinny attack because he knows better. You almost did the spinny attack. Get out of here with the spin. Oh, we missed. Oh, we got him. What did I say? You are not listening, dude. Nailed it. Oh boy. Alright. This feels like I'm like beating Isaac with base damage, to be honest, and like I don't really like it because we have some pretty good items. Like it's been a while since I've like had to do this with fighting Isaac. So I'm not really like super thrilled about it. I mean like we have okay speed, which makes it a little bit easier, and the soul actually helps out quite a bit. But I hate this. Like, oh my god. Oh my god. I walked into the fucking tier. <sighs> that was my fault. That one was my bad. That was my bad. Guppy's gone. Okay, 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 okay. I think we took off more than we did on the last one. That was a good bomb. Wonderful bomb. Get bombs, son. I'm gonna use all my bombs. Because I freaking hate the Isaac fight sometimes. Oh, this is like freaking Pong on level 172. Ha. Yes. All right, bombs in there. No. No. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, okay. Okay. Losing my mind on this Isaac fight. Got freaking death touch sin robes in all my might. It's good, uh, good shot there. Thank you. Freaking guillotine. By the way, I don't think guillotine is what uh, is really losing us this run. Oh my god, we did it. <sighs> okay, up we go. Mm. Two lives, two hearts, the entirety of the chest. Let's go. Fucking curse of the blind, though. Oh, my God. That's like God awful. Also, if you're wondering, like, hey, you got 99 bombs. Why don't you bomb your way out to some of these rooms? Uh, you can't. In the chest, you cannot bomb your way out. I will prove it to you because we have 99 bombs. See? They're all considered special rooms, so buckle in. There we go. Just, you know what? It's orbital time. It's orbital time. Uh, we are going to reroll that when we get a second. Okay. You know what? You know what? Not cool, not cool, not cool. Not cool. I said not cool. I really don't care who I beat last year. I guess maybe we should try for um, uh, um, um, uh, Gluttony last. 
Let's do that. Okay. Alright, well there goes that. Thank you, Sloth. Alright, it flew off the screen. Makes sense. It sucked me in. Now we're blue baby. Alright. I forgot we had the onk. Oh my god, that was terrible. I'm losing my mind, though. Oh, I forgot you do that. Thank you, soul. Ah, okay, Mega Fatty's gotta go. You know what? I'm thinking if um, if it's looking like really dire, or if we actually do die, um, I want to check out some of the other stuff that, <laughs> um, that the the item like synergizes with, just to see kind of what uh, what works with it, kind of thing. So we might maybe just spin up like a quick run or something and check it out with um, Tech X or something like that, or an item along those lines, just to see. Sad bombs would be another one that I'd want to check, so we'll, we'll we'll do that. But I am gonna try to uh, to win here. That's what I was looking for there. And you may be saying like, if you're really trying to win, why are you walking into enemies? It's because like my damage is shit though. Okay, come on. Like we're gonna get hit here. We didn't get hit here. So far. Oh, we got hit. You gotta go. And you gotta go. Please don't fire your brimstone. Jesus. Thank you for doing that right in the wall. Excuse me, I shot rocks. Oh, we almost died right there. Yumheart, are you friggin' me right now? Are you friggin' me? None of those people died? Okay. I guess it doesn't really look like it's doing a lot of damage. It's not really doing a lot of damage. You've got to fart off, though. Oh my god, you've gotta go. Give me a chest, please. Sure. F me. They blew it away. Stop with the spiders and the freaking earthquakes. And the brimstone. Oh my god, I thought I walked into it. Okay. No problem. Okay, yeah, no, just bear with me like... Frig. Alright, what did I say I wanted to try? Let's do this. Alright, there's a couple that I want to try. Let's spawn that and then give item loot. Oh, C329. I just want to see how this works. Okay. So now we got Ludo. That is really cool. Is that any better than what I had? That seems pretty good. You know what? I wonder... Just bear with me. Like, don't do this stage. Uh, what is it? 
12? No. 11A. I just want to see if, like, this would have been enough. Like, it doesn't really seem... I mean, like, we just skipped the entirety of the run, but... Even this seems already better than what we had. Okay. Okay. No problem. No problem. So now we're going to exit. Check out new run. One more. I wanted to see Tech X. That was the one I wanted to see because they say that it does work with it. Uh, give. No, no. Spawn. Space. Wow. 5.100.530. And I don't feel like going through the entirety to figure out what tech X is, so we'll give item tech X. There we go. Check this. That seems pretty cool, although charge bars doesn't seem to work. Okay, yeah, no, run into me. Yeah, that's pretty neat, okay. I just want to try like one more room. I don't know why that wasn't charged. Yeah, I don't know why charge bars don't work with it. Anyway, um, I'm going to exit there. I'm going to call the episode. Um, that was Quake Shot. Overall, I think it's really good, but I think there's a little bit of work that needs to be done on it in terms of not even like item synergies and so forth, just kind of to make it feel a little bit more stronger i guess is what i want to say because it doesn't really feel super strong right now it feels a little underpowered uh not by much but by a bit um based on the items that we had i felt like we should have had no real problem taking on um adversary or the chest or even isaac for that matter but we didn't so that that's kind of how i feel about it but it is a very good mod if you like i'm just going to call the episode if you guys like what you saw feel free to give me a like and sub it means the world to me it can also be found on twitter twitter.com slash jonas fatson or on twitch twitch.tv slash jonas thanks so much for tuning in peace out